let me just process life and my existence before I wake up. <laughs> I don't want to go to school. I just want to sleep. But I need to have good grades, so it's time to wake up. Okay, <sighs> I'm up. Hi, guys. So it's currently 6 a.m. as I vlog this, and I look awful. But you know what? It doesn't matter. Anyways, today I'm going to be doing my realistic this school morning routine. But in book box. And for those wondering, I already graduated high school in real life, but I still wanted to show you guys what my routine looked like when I did have to go to school. So yeah, enjoy me being miserable as I get ready. I'm kidding, I'm not, I'm not miserable. I do sound dead tired, but I'm not, I promise. But anyways, the first thing I do when I wake up before I do anything is check my phone. Let's be real here. Everybody does this, okay? We like to check all of our social medias, our messages, everything. But yeah, here I am just checking my phone, seeing if my friend or anyone important texted me. Oh look, oh my God, they did it, I'm a clown. I'm kidding, but like comment if you relate and follow my socials, thank you. So once I'm done mindlessly scrolling, I go pee. Look, I don't know if I, but whatever. That's me being real, that's what I do. So after I do that, I go and wash my hands. We gotta make sure that we're hygienic and we have no cooties. You guys do not wash your hands after using the toilet. You are gross, so wash your hands always. Thank you. We don't want no diseases. And after I wash my hands, I wash my face and I brush my teeth. I consider washing my face in the morning very important because it helps me wake up and get rid of all the germs from your pillows and all that stuff that may happen overnight. Overall, just makes me feel refreshed and ready to put on makeup later. Also, it's very important to take care of your skin, so using a good face wash and good moisturizer is essential for your face. In real life i use the cerave foaming facial cleanser this is really gentle on my skin and it helps get rid of impurities so i would totally recommend it and i also use the cerave moisturizing lotion and by the way this is just what works for me but i am not a dermatologist so if you have any questions related to your skin then be sure to go to one and now here's me brushing my teeth because i don't want stinky breath dental hygiene is so important guys you do not want people to sniff your breath and faint okay so brush your teeth okay so now that my main routine is done now i'm going to be making my bed and choosing my outfit for school cool and to be completely honest with you guys sometimes i don't make my bed because i'm like really lazy or like i have a rush to do something and go to school but like since i love my, my mom, mom and i don't want her to rage, rage you get yeah. mad and i also like having my room organized i try to always do my bed And there we go, we did it. And something that I've realized is that whenever I make my bed, I just feel way more productive. I read some research that whenever you guys have a messy bedroom or anything, your brain also feels messy. A messy place is a messy mind. So always stay organized, not only for your surroundings to be clean, but also for your brain. Okay, so now I'm just gonna get my outfit for school. And me doing this is not super realistic because my real life school, I had to use a uniform. But you know what, since this is Roblox, I'm gonna be choosing my own outfit for school. But by the way, I do kind of like uniforms because I thought it was cute. And also, I kind of do like the idea of everybody being equal and having the same outfit. It removes the hassle of having to choose an outfit every day. But once again, I want to be stylish. Roblox, let's go. Okay, so this is the outfit I chose. I got a pink cardigan with a white crop top and jeans. And for accessories, I got my iconic, really cutesy hair clips and my watermelon necklace, which you guys can buy in my Roblox fan group. So be sure to join and support. Thank you. But yeah, now it's time to go shower because we ain't about to be stinky or anything for school. We need to smell really good. Like watermelons and strawberries with vanilla. Okay, so before I shower, I just put on this shower cap because I'm, I'm really, really not, not trying, trying to ruin the curls. I haven't even taken them out and like, I'm not ruining my hair, you know? I also have a bathtub, but in real life, I don't, so I just shower. Trying to avoid my hair getting wet. So thank you, shower cap, for existing. Although, I always get a little bit of my hair wet, even if I have a shower cap, so that's kind of annoying, but it's whatever. My real life showering products honestly vary because it really depends on the season, my mood, and whatever I really want to smell like. But for the most part, I've been mostly using some Dove Sensitive Skin Body Washes. My skin is pretty sensitive and this product has really helped me. Once I'm done showering, it's time to get ready. And oops, I just drenched the floor with water. It's whatever, it'll dry. And there we go. This is how my outfit looks on me. I think I look pretty cute. But now it's time to glamorize myself. So now I'm going to be taking my curlers off. And I expect really beautiful curls or else I'm going to scream. And here's me taking them off. And voila, these are my luscious, beautiful curls, which looks super pretty and good on me. And also another thing that I like to do is I like to sleep in braids. And then when you guys wake up, it turns out really pretty. That's a Bella tip. Sleep in braids. It turns out amazing. And if it doesn't, then oops, oops never mind. <laughs> Okay, so now I'm going to be accessorizing. We need some hair clips, earrings, and a necklace. And then after that, we begin our makeup. So let me get it from my jewelry. There we go. And now we're slaying. But yeah, be sure to buy these things in my Belfam Roblox group. Gracias. But anyways, before I do my makeup, I just realized that the sun has started to rise. So look at the view, guys. See? 
getting an apartment in Barry Avenue was an amazing choice. The sun is shining as much as me. Actually, am I really shining? <laughs> okay, so for my makeup, I typically like to use concealer, mascara, eyeliner, blush, and lipstick. And if I'm feeling a bit extra, then I'll use some eyeshadow as well. But like, like, I'm, I'm usually, usually always, always extra. extra. I'm using a lot of eyeshadow. My favorite tones for my skin color is pink, gold, and blue. So yeah, that's what I do. And for all the girls and people that do not use makeup, just know that is perfectly fine. I personally like using makeup because it helps me enhance my natural beauty, and it just makes me feel way more confident. And it's basically art because I can do whatever the heck I want. If I'm feeling like a mermaid, I can do the mermaid look. If I'm feeling peachy and pink or like watermelon, I can do that too with my eyeshadow. But yeah, guys, do whatever you are comfortable with. And if your, your parents, parents allow it, of course. course. But yeah, for those who didn't know, I started wearing makeup at a kind of an early age, but that's only because my sister is a makeup artist. So I've always kind of like loved it as well because she would do my makeup and everything. If you're young, you can wear some subtle makeup or anything. But remember, it's not because you need it. It's because you want to. And of course, if your parents let you. And now to finish off the look, I like to use a NARS lipstick mixed in with some Pixi On The Glow blush slash like lipstick. And then I top it off with a Fenty Beauty heat gloss balm. That way I keep my lips looking juicy. And there we go. This is my finalized makeup look and kind of what I usually wear in real life. For school though, I typically have to use something a little bit more simpler as in like my eyeshadow. So I typically go for gold, but since it's Roblox, I'm doing whatever the heck I want and I'm getting pink. So yeah. And here's a picture of me in real life for reference. Okay, so by the time I am ready and done with my makeup and all that jazz, it's usually around like 7.15 and my school starts at 8. So that means I need to hurry the heck up and get some food. And if I take too long, then I do not have any food. But in this case, I want food. So we need to hurry the heck up. Now I'm going downstairs and I'm heading to the kitchen. And wow, guys, look how pretty my apartment is. Be sure to check out my apartment video if you guys want a tour. Okay, so my breakfast for school, it would typically always be oatmeal with blueberries and strawberries or cereal. Because realistically, that's what I had enough time time to make. I ain't gonna be cooking pancakes when I have to go be in school in like 20 minutes. You know what I mean? That's not gonna happen. For sometimes, I would eat some peanut butter and jelly sandwiches, peanut butter with banana. You know the drill. Basically, easy thing. So first, I'm gonna be checking my fridge and let's see what I have. Zero. I have nothing. All I have is fruit. Oh, look, I have some peanut butter. Maybe I could have that. Ooh, and some watermelons. Y'all know me. You know how much I love watermelons. Yeah, comment down below what your favorite breakfast is. Okay, so since I'm really hungry and I kind of stayed up late yesterday, I'm going to be eating oatmeal and I'm also gonna get some toast with banana. I think that's a pretty good breakfast. So let's set it up. But first, we put the bread in the toaster and then we wait. Next, we're gonna be getting our bread and putting some peanut butter on it and then some bananas. This is how it turned out. Bro, peanut butter with banana is superior. If you say otherwise, you suck. Cause like, it's so good. Oh my God. Okay, then for oatmeal, I usually just get the Quaker instant oatmeal and then I just add some milk in it and some cinnamon and sugar and then I just put it in the microwave. It's done and this is what it kind of looks like. Now it's time to devour the food like my life depends on it. Although my, my life, life does depend on it. So let's take a seat and let's start eating. Okay, then after I eat, I go and wash the dishes because I do not have a dishwasher in real life. So I must do the labor. As we all should, we should stop being lazy. Let's do it. And then here I am washing the dishes. Oh, oh look, I'm being a woman. I'm kidding, guys. Do not ever say that joke, especially if you are a man. And now it's 7.45 and I need to hurry the heck up unless I want to be late to my class. Yay! So let's go. But anyways, whenever I went to school, my mom would take me. But since this is Roblox, I'm gonna do it myself. So let's go. Independent queen. And here we are. I made it to my favorite place in this world. I'm, I'm kidding. kidding. I hate this place. Please get me out of here. <laughs> oh, crap. I just ruined my makeup. <sighs> Put yourself together, Bella. But anyways, guys, I'm in school now. So I guess that's it for today's vlog. Yeah, if you guys want more videos like this, then be sure to comment down below. And be sure to like and subscribe. Oh, and be sure to follow my social media if you guys want more real life exclusive content. And let me know if you guys want me to do these types of videos, but in real life. So kind of like a vlog tip. Yeah, I love you guys. Bye. No, but for real, please like and subscribe. Thank you. Bye. Woo.